Welcome back to News 9. You know, finals are just a few weeks away for Oklahoma college students, but that's not the only major factor causing stress and anxiety for students. Our campus correspondent Libby Dean spoke with students about mental health and trying to balance it all. It's really hard to balance like what I need to do for school and what I need to do for work. And a lot of the times I have to let one of the two things slide. I work whenever I don't have class and I'm in class when I don't work. Some college students who balance a full-time job in school say their mental health takes a back seat. It definitely affects my mental health. I would say it affects it more in a negative light. They also see the impact on other aspects of their life. I would say like probably the hardest part is balancing a social life. I have to miss a lot of my like college experience, especially in the past two years. It's been really hard to maintain and keep up with my social life. Mental health professionals give students strategies for trying to balance it all. I always encourage them to, to think of their time like a budget. And whenever you have a budget of money, you make sure that you pay your bills first. While considering a time management solution, it is important to factor in time for yourself. I think it's important for them to understand what self-care is for them in doing things that they enjoy individually as well as with with others. Yes. And, and Libby, I know that uh, you have looked into some resources also available for students that attend universities. Yeah, on campus there's a ton of um, counseling available as well as just student peer groups mm -hmm. who meet and um, talk about all the stress that they feel having work school and these full-time schedules. Mm -hmm. yeah. What do you do? Because you're getting ready to graduate in five <laughs> weeks. You're trying to find a job still, yes, right? And yeah. you've got a lot on your plate. Yeah, I think it's just really important to, I actually schedule my day by the hour mm -hmm. because I'm like, if I don't, oh I have to I have to do that or I find myself like on my phone for too long or um, mm -hmm. on social media, you know, so it's really just important for me to schedule things out. I love how you said like sometimes the best resources is just your peers and talking mm -hmm. and putting yeah. into words what you're feeling and the emotions that you're going through and stuff like that. Because right. sometimes just getting it off your chest mm -hmm. physically makes you feel better. So mm -hmm. yeah, peers are important and also if you need professional help, always that's an option it's that okay. is important. It's okay to yeah. say you need help. I think one thing that, you know, my son's a, a junior and I can see him processing his emotions and it's, it's kind of maturing and trying to work through it and so it just takes a little time sometimes yeah. as well. Libby yeah. Dean, good job today. Thanks. Thanks, Thanks Libby. Thanks, All right, let's get straight.